Hey, hello there, uh, what's up? It's Ami, an 80, and I'm back on track with a, well, let's say fresh and a pretty fantastic video on the channel in VR. That's right, today we are going to make our return to the Super Mario VR experience developed by Nimzo. As you may know, he recently updated his demo with a bunch of fresh stuff. He added Vive support, a menu full of new settings, and it can now be played with motion controllers as well. We are going to check this all out with the Vive Pro and discover all its secrets and surprises. And that sounds like a plan to me. Now it's time to jump into the metaverse and uh, have some fun, of course. Let's -a go! Ladies and gentlemen, Boys and girls, uh, may I welcome you to the one and only Super Mario VR experience. That's right. This is going to be an absolute blast. It's going to be awesome. Trust me. It's been a while ago I played this demo, but it's good to be back. Before we are going to dive deeper into the uh, VR oasis and become Super Mario again, I will have to show you a bunch of settings. They are very, very important. Don't skip them, I warn you. The first one is in the left corner. If you turn it on, you will use Vive controls and if you turn it off, you will use uh, Rift controls. Please match this with the headset you are wearing and then you will be totally fine. Don't get confused by the controllers though. They do not change when you mess around with the settings. I think Nimzo still needs to add a pair of uh, Vive controllers in the same style. Stay tuned for that. And if you want to know how you move around, just look at the sign itself it tells you everything you need to know then we have these settings you can turn them on or off that's totally up to you be my guest then we have this sign that allows you to change your height just uh, match it with the correct number and then simply hit reset bam done did it easy peasy that's all you need to know Okay, so here we are in the world of Super Mario. Wow. Oh, this is weird. The sun is shining, the sky is blue. We got a bunch of Goombas walking around. I can finally die in peace. This is stunning. This is beautiful. It's like I'm stuck in a Nintendo Switch. Mind blowing. So as you can see, I'm using a proxy mat and the reason why I'm using this is to keep myself safe because usually when I play these kind of demos, I get way too excited because I want to destroy a couple of blocks, I want to jump on a bunch of Goombas and uh, most importantly, I want to catch all the coins that I can find in this level. And w when I'm doing that, I totally forget about real life and I get so immersed that I think I can just go wherever I want, but that's of course not how it works. I'm still surrounded by a few walls, so with this mat I, I just get reminded that I should stay in my little play space and that real life is still a thing as well. So yeah, this is super handy. It's going to uh, work in my favor, that's for sure, especially in a game like this one where you physically need to move a lot. Yeah, there's a, a shadow here from, from Super Mario, the 8-bit version to be more precise. Nice little easter egg. Well done, Nimzo. And yeah, I got hands. I know, I know. This is epic. Now I can finally be Super Mario in its full glory. This totally adds up to the uh, immersion. I can remember that the first uh, demo I played, I could only use a gamepad. Yeah, I, I, I didn't really feel it, no, but this... This is nice, this is great. So let's uh, go and uh, start playing. Yes, so you need to jog to move around. You can also jump. Woohoo! It's a me, an 80. Woo, sweet dreams. Mamma mia. Okay. So yeah, you just need to do that classic Mario move and then you jump. That's all you have to do. <laughs> oh, this is next level. Please, Nintendo. Dip your toes into VR. It's mind-blowing. It's amazing. The possibilities are basically endless. Oh. You can also smash a block if you want. Or grab a coin like that. Ooh, 
Can we go into this pipe? No, that's not going to work. If you need a little bit of guidance, you can also read these signs. They are definitely going to help you out. I can also highly recommend playing this uh, demo with the uh, Oculus Rift instead of the Vive. The Vive does the trick, but the touch controllers are way more accurate in this one because you can use the thumbsticks instead of the touchpad. The touchpad is too sensitive in this, uh, in this tech demo. Hello there. Can I hug you? Aw, cuteness overload! Boop. Oh, he doesn't have a nose. Never mind. Oh, that jumping animation, you see that? If you got a front-facing experience, you can also turn your view around, you see? If you got a 360 play space, you don't really need to use it. And that's why the touch controllers are a little better in this experience, because I keep on touching the, the sides of the touchpad and then my view goes all over the place. So you need to be uh, extremely careful. Don't get motion sick. Can I... I want to go into this pipe, but I can't. Why? Impossible. Wait. Oh! Oh! Oh, that was weird. <laughs> my brain does not compute. Oh, that sound, it's orgasmic. Oh, this works so much better than a gamepad. The freedom is real. Okay. Let's go outside. Oh. Oh, we skipped a part of, a, of the level, of course. I totally forgot. So, can we go back? I'm, I'm way too curious. Oh, oh. Oh, that's dangerous. No, 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 no! Ah! Mamma mia! That escalated way too quickly, I know, I know, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It will never happen again, I promise. Oh! Come on, come back here! Yes, no! You really need to hit them on the top of their head if you want to kill them. It's all about precision here. Ooh. Gimme, gimme, gimme. My precious. Oh, no, we are not going to do this again. Ooh, ooh, okay. I did it. I'm still alive. Remember, gamers never die, they respawn, right? I mean, I don't really need to worry about anything. Hey, you. What is your name? Goomba? Oh, how original. So I'm, I'm trying to... <laughs> Yes, you can jump really high if you want to. But uh, it depends on how much speed you have at that very moment. So the faster you go, the higher you jump. So can we, can we get up here? Yes, we can. Oh, mmm, me likey. <laughs> I really do. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. Hi! What's up? There are so many Goombas here. It's nuts. Oh! That trick! Did you see that? That was so sick. <laughs> so this is an intense experience. It's not, it's not for everyone, okay? But it does show walking locomotion in its full glory and at its full potential as well. Oh, that was a big fat Goomba. Mmm. It's so satisfying to jump onto their little, little hats. <laughs> Come on, gimme, gimme, gimme. I need more. <laughs> so if you want to check out this experience yourselves as well, you can. It's completely oh, free. I will make sure there is a link. Ah! in the description uh, below, if you are interested. I'll also add a link to Nimzo's uh, website because he's doing a lot more than only creating Super Mario stuff. He also made that Sonic VR uh, game and he's constantly searching for new 
locomotion options. I just want to have that yellow block. <laughs> okay, how are we going to do this? Yeah, no! I can't jump that high. Or maybe I can. No, no, no! Yeah, I know, I know. I broke my promise, but... You know, Super Mario in VR is a, is a total different experience. It's a lot harder compared to playing it on a console, I'm, I'm not joking. It maybe looks easy on the screen, but it's, it's, it's not, it's not that, that easy, no. It's, it's actually tricky, very tricky. You will have to practice a lot if you want to play this properly. I spent at least an hour in VR today to warm myself up to play this, okay? Oh, that's the giant Goomba. My days. That's terrifying. Hey. Can I, uh... Haha! <laughs> Prank! Oh. Seriously, if you, if you can get a coin from all the way up there, it feels so good. Imagine playing an actual Nintendo VR game made by Nintendo. That would be so, so epic. I don't even know if that's gonna happen in the near future, but I hope Nintendo does see the potential of VR. Let me know in the comments below what Nintendo game you would like to see in VR. I think I would go for Mario Kart. Yeah. Throwing bananas at your friends would be so nice. There is a Mario Kart GP VR game, but it's only for arcades. I would like to see one that is actually laying in the stores. For now, I will have to strap a switch to my face if I want to experience Nintendo games in uh, VR. That's of course a uh, joke. It is possible, you could, you could do that, but... Even a better idea is to hook up your Switch to your computer and then play it on a big screen in VR. That's a quick tip from Natey himself. So don't, don't, don't die, Natey, don't die. Okay, here we go, here we go. Oh, no, 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 oh. I don't know if I can do this, the, the pressure. Okay, I do need to move if I wanna jump. Okay, okay, I made it, I made it. Thank God I made it. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, we're almost there. We're almost done. Oh! Two Goombas with one jump. I'm an expert. So you can't really go there. It's, it's, it's only this level, you see? The, the, the view is, is fantastic. Anyway, let's -a go for the end of the level. Ooh, okay, can we do this? Can we do this? I hope so, I hope so. Stop, stop turning around. Like, the touchpad is too sensitive for this, for this experience. Seriously, with a thumbstick, you will not run into these issues that much. Okay, so, please, please, just, just for one second. Okay, and... Oh, no! No! How is it even possible? I will have to go back. How anticlimactic, right? Okay. This is uh, going to be my uh, second uh, try. I can do this. Just believe in yourself, Natey. That's all you have to do. Yes! Woo! Nailed it! Bam! That's how you do it. Okay, thank you for playing the SMB VR Tech Demo. Look for Odyssey Experience soon. Yeah, if you want to know more about his Mario Odyssey Experience, then go to his website. It's in the description. Challenges, go back through the level and find each of these uh, things. Purple wire pipe, gold wire pipe, red, blue and yellow Tetris shapes, gold brick block, and last but not least, a small brick block and a tiny brick block. Small and tiny? What the heck? Okay, so I will give you one hint. There is one on the left. It's the golden wire pipe. Ah, oh, it's so shiny. I, uh, I wonder how much you can 
sell that for on eBay. <laughs> a golden pipe from the Mario game itself. I think a lot of people would be interested in buying that. So yeah, I think it's now time for us to jump to the outro and uh, end this video. Let's -a go! Mamma mia! Okay, that's it. Whew. Oh man, it's, it's it's so hot in my room. This is this is a good workout. I'm I'm not joking. But Nimzo, this update, it's 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 amazing. Okay, it really is. So yeah, let me uh, take a break for now, and uh, I will come back to you later. So see ya. Whew. Oh man. And that, ladies and gentlemen, was Super Mario in VR. I hope you enjoyed uh, watching this video. If you did, then be sure to slam that like button as always and let me know in the comments below what I should play uh, next. That would be nice. So again, there is a link in the description below to this uh, Super Mario demo. If you want to check it out, then you can. It's completely free. You can play it with the Oculus Rift or the HTC Vive. And now it's time for me to sign off. And as I always say, and I see you guys uh, next time. See you in the metaphors. See you later. Bye bye. Woohoo!